Well, here's the run back from FlyQuest. Hi. Yeah. Gonna take Jarvan into the Z again, and I think Zara gonna complete the comp. I'm putting on the brave face and saying it's all about winning the series here. We'll see if Dignitas can do that. Oh, good yeah. flash by Sunday following in. Balls actually should be dead here. Isolation is enough, and that's first blood for the Kha'Zix. He isolated himself uh, by flashing out of the minion wave to make the kill fairly easy, and what a oh, good Oh, especially with a fake tech. Moon misses the bowler, and special flashes out. He cannot afford those mistakes. Get a flash twisted advance onto him and potentially get a kill, but they don't want to get too aggressive because the chance of a counter gank is very real. And even at level five, oh. his damage is high. There it is. Someday flashes in, Ball's in trouble again. Should be another kill. Ball's trap shield on, but not enough. Someday gets that kill. Watch the mid lane one more time here. Let's see, he cues in, and it's actually Keen who just gets aggressive. High just popping his W shield and barely living through knowing they're playing TSM later this week. You can see them with Team Dignitas just making coaching change, not oh. taking it seriously. It's special. Black Force and Lemon Nation to Flash, so good attempt there from Lemon Nation. Not level six, so couldn't really complete an all-in, but Chase are right behind his support as well. Dignitas kind of had a wake-up wake up call with the coaching change, and while Cop can't make any huge changes in two days, the mentality could bring to the rest of the team could help. That's a nice roll though from Special, I think dead. Yeah, Moon takes him out. Log Force to Flash. Gets himself out, but he couldn't save his support. Oh man, just a perfect roam. As I was talking about how FlyQuest was slumping and Dignitas was coming back. You can see pings as well from Dignitas. They know that people have been waiting in that bush. Moon has not left the area yet either, so this is a long con to try and get a kill, and they want it. Or just goes through the turret. Yeah, brute force instead. Gonna take the turret down. Smart zoning there. Moon actually gets his way out from under the W, but turret's gonna fall down. Jim Bullet's still launching in though. Tagged almost all four onto Moon, I believe. The cost. Lemonation still has ultimate. Ooh, doesn't quite get it. There's the plant. Six special goes in, but he gets himself ultimate. And Keen's up here as well, though. Should be able to play clean if special gets one for Lemonation. Now Moon getting dived on by Keen. Damage is there. The pop is good. Keen gets another. I'll take a look Ooh. at the chase down. Chase gets a double kill for himself, though. And the rest of the cavalry's here. It's a 5v5 erupting. Teleport coming in from Someday. Someday locks down High. Looking to try and take him down, but High's in the back already. Blows up Log with a combo. And now Keen and Altec fighting up, but Keen's got no cooldowns to play with. Balls burning down Someday on the top right. Altec gets the other kill on Balls. Wants to take out Someday. Someday with the flash as Balls can flash as well. Harpoon's in for one. Needs another. There's a second slow flame spinner in. Someday tries to turn and fight. Balls needs a pit bar and he gets himself the kill. And you can see Mountain Drake over for FlyQuest. Dignity has traded the top outer turret for it. His Lemon Nation off to play! Oh, yeah! Whoa! Oh, Kyle wins, and that's a kill on Duquesne. Lemon Nation trapped by Someday will go down, but Someday gonna get dove by High Moon. There's a knockoff, Lancy for Jarvan, the double kill! This is what High envisioned the last time he picked Jarvan. He's thinking, we're gonna be flashing over walls, diving turrets, and one-shotting people, and then even killing the tank who has had to build spec against Rumble, so they're able to kill him with their two physical damage dealers down the stretch right there. Good when they have a lead. Oh. Altec, though, needs to dodge the plants, team. Yeah. Lemonation blocks the first. There's the second. Running out of the area. Altec safe. Special the bro takes all three. Malzahar should almost always take the first one because his spell shield will block it. Or rather, his super shield that basically blocks everything will stop it. Look out, though, for high. Edge of Night channeled high. Can't really 1v2, I don't think. In fact, Keen might finish him off solo. Chaser runs in. High, gonna take a bit of extra poke. Oh, it's not enough! He goes back in! Oh, he wanted it so bad. Nice play by Keen to just press E as High was jumping in and kind of avoid that potential cataclysm burst. High burning everything in an attempt to escape. Teleport coming in from Team Dignitas, though, not wanting to give up this turret. Sunday for the flank. Moon already caught up by Kane. Sunday trying to find a position where they suppress Kane. He's going to go down to the Malzahar. And now Chaser exhausted. Looks to dive in for it. Sunday trying to tank shots, but he's already down 40% health. Good equalizer there by Ball. Trying to cut off a lot of Sunday flash down, but Ball straight into the mix. Burns them all down. Lot gets the kill, but they're going to answer a few back. So low. Barely lives it now. Chaser gets the reset. Altec doesn't get hit by the other side. It's exceptional. Cracks 2,000. And that's the type of fight to get it for you. They get the turret down the stretch, but this is again turning into one of those really high action games. Here comes Altec with a 1v2. Can he do it? I mean, his Team Dignitas want to go for it. Altec playing so aggressive out of mana. Not now. Gets them back. Actually earlier, in 20 seconds now. High again, lining it up once. Someday, use the ultimate balls as the equalizer ready to go. Misses the first harpoon and now Chase is here to defend. 
Do they keep going though? Rengar all popped. Ultimate committed. Moon's gonna try and cut them off at the pass, but they're a little too late. Moon almost in position, but the rest What's of it? here. Moon goes in for it once. Chaser, but Chaser leads out. A special caught up on the other side though. Who's gonna go down? Altex the traders keep shuts him down. And FlyQuest is relentless with these dives. Even though someday look to repel the first one, FlyQuest recognized they could get more people to the spot before Team Dignitas could match. And they get a two for one, as well as push this turret. Lord looks for high, high gets out of the way. Moon tanking all the shots, King can finish Keen. him off. Doesn't get him, no, now King's caught out. Lloyd Lee's gonna chase him down, Elimination. Able to get that next kill. Someday not there in time. Yeah, and it's also much harder to engage on the team that has the Rumble and the Malzahar. High, looking to make a highlight oh, reel. What? Misses that Q. Keen though, just defensively ultimating high. Does have his QSS now, does Keen, so Elimination's not gonna have nearly as juicy a target. Grouping his five right here. They're worried about the Baron. This is the Baron force the Fly Quest have been rating for. Some days leading the pack though, oh, they're going on him. Actually gonna go in for it. That's a good damage. He's actually gonna evaporate by the looks of things. Leaves for a little while longer, and the damage is back on the other side. Keen dives in to try and finish it off as Lot gets a couple of snipes down. That's three kills for one now as Keen falls as balls is the only sacrifice for Fly Quest. Very interesting fight. Lot's still chasing. FlyQuest lost too much health, perhaps. But they're going to keep this pressure up. Altec ultimate. There's a special caught out. Goodbye, Altec. Able to take him out. Chasing against the red buff, but Moon's chasing in. FlyQuest, 5v4, looking for the Baron. Lot's going to get the ulti in there. Sapling might give them a bit of extra vision, but the, the Baron's almost break. dead. Chase they're going to get suppressed. They need to kill him before he gets it. Chase they get him. He stole the Baron. And Dignitas now chasing in. Moon gets aggressed on his Altec being chased in by King. Almost dead. There's one for the Zed. Ball's going to get chased in as well. And there's a double kill for King. Oh, my God. Team Dignitas come up clutch at Baron, as usual, as we're expecting right there. The Baron steal happens. And oh man, Keen's gonna get out of there scot-free as well. They go for the suppress, and someday coming in here, interrupting the suppression to unlock Chaser for the flash steal was awesome. So the rest of Team Dignitas then get to pile in with the ultimate from Jin, and Keen is unleashed since the suppression was used prior. He gets a double kill on the back end, and then the rest of Fly just have to turn tail and run. That equalizes the game. I mean, certainly does. I mean, Chaser leans back, he's dead, but he's pretty happy with himself. He needs to be able to complete that last whisper to be able to cut through the Maokai a little bit. And here comes FlyQuest, always looking for that play. Can they catch one? Looking for Sunday again, gonna get chunked down there. Damage is good, but a special flash is in. Huge turnaround from Dignitas. Whoa. Just gonna turn it on its head. Pull there from one snipe everyone, and Sunday. Who's oh, only his GA. And he comes right back up. They can't burst someday before he can proc his Courage of the Colossus shield on everyone. And patient time, this is exactly what we were talking about. FlyQuest will jump into you, but will it work? And this series, the answer has been emphatically no. And Team Dignitas with a five for zero ace, storm up mid lane. That was the cleanest ace I've seen in a while. Mid inhibitor broken as Dignitas just absorbed the first punch and annihilate FlyQuest. What they can't see him. Moon's gonna spot a special, he's just again. in for it. Oh, that's a good one. Gonna blow him up, and there's a kill for Altec. Good ult there from Ball, this high's in. Really wants to take down Lord, flashes towards him, but Keen peels it off as Lord gets the kill. Chase the snared up, but he gets himself out of the way, as that's another kill on the back end for Altec. Sunday takes him down with the help from Zed. Dignitas playing it so well, get another ace. And now they have the Baron, they have the minions in the mid lane, and I think Team Dignitas is gonna pick up the win against FlyQuest. Certainly looks like the sweep is imminent. Someday teleports his way in to try and finish it off. Super minions gonna help out in a big way. Wow, what a wacky game, I'd have to say. 44 kills, FlyQuest just throwing themselves at Team Dignitas over and over again. And Team Dignitas is able to hit back in battle. They take their punches with ease and clean through FlyQuest in the series.